This video brought to you by Weatherworks XMWX Satellite Weather and by the Bose Headset 10. More pilots trust XMWX Satellite Weather than any other satellite delivered weather service. Known for its accuracy and reliability, XMWX Satellite Weather is leading the way to fly for pilots around the country in flight and every flight. Every major avionics company has glass of some kind, but all have approached the design brief a little bit differently. Bendix King has pursued a top-down strategy incorporating high-end BizJet features in its new Apex Edge EFA system. We visited Bendix King's booth at Sun and Fun for a program update from Clark Beatty. This is the Apex Edge series of, of equipment. This was designed with the general aviation pilot in mind, designed for general aviation and general aviation prices. And the idea is to take some of the, the great things we've done in our higher and business jets, Primus Epic and Primus Apex, hence the name of the Apex Edge series, and bring them into general aviation. So for example, what you'll see here are things that are easy to use, intuitive to read, and they're robust in terms of their system interfaces. So on one side you have the KFD-840. The KFD-840 is a primary flight display designed to replace your existing six-pack. It has symbology that's taken from business jet genre, if you will, a legacy of business jets that we have. It includes the airspeed indicator, of course the altimeter, the vertical speed, the attitude indicator, as well as the directional gyro. In addition to that, we've got a, a very simple set of uh, buttons. Uh, the bearing, for example, we can select different bearings, whether we have VOR or GPS. Likewise, on the second bearing, and the circle diamond, circle bearing and the diamond bearing are something that are familiar to us and, again, brought in from the higher-end business effects. CBI will allow you to couple to up to four different GPS and navigation sources, and they can couple up to the autopilot. And in addition to that, we have a checklist feature, and then you have a display feature for the, for the ARC, so we can display either a full compass or a partial compass. And the checklist on, you come here and have a user preloaded checklist through the SD card. SN 770 is a fully WAS capable GPS receiver with an integrated NAVCOM receiver and a large high resolution screen for, um, for displaying things like charts and weather radar. And as you can see here, it's got not only a cursor interface, but it's got the hard keys along the side for those things that are most, uh, most often accessed. An overlay button to overlay different safety sensors. A thumbnail, kind of like a picture in the picture to display. Um, for example, you have weather on one display, you could have terrain on the other, volume controls for your radio, and your flip-flop buttons, of course, for your radio as well. The KFD-840 is finishing its certification program. It will be available by Oshkosh, and we'll be taking orders. We're taking orders now through dealers. We're working through dealers now. Presented by Bose Aviation Headset 10, voted number one for the eighth consecutive year in Professional Pilots 2008 Annual Headset Preference Survey. Today's Aviation Headset 10 delivers a highly acclaimed combination of noise reduction, clearer audio, and comfort that remains unmatched. Learn more at Bose.com slash headset.